Hello and a very warm welcome to British Royal Daily Update's YouTube channel. On Friday, Meghan Markle wore clothes and jewellery worth almost a quarter of a million pounds as she attended the Invictus Games. The 42-year-old Duchess of Sussex changed her outfits twice, combining high street and high-end pieces with extremely pricey jewellery. She started the day with a £40 cream-coloured Zara playsuit that matched her £1,350 Celine blazer, joining Prince Harry at the Invictus Games. The royal added some sparkle to her look at the Mercaspiel arena with loose waves in her hair. A glamorous makeup look and fashionable black leather sandals, from Yves Saint Laurent that cost £595. She also carried a £600 crossover bag in Olive Grove from Sesta Collective and wore £250 sunglasses from Crew. Meghan accessorized her outfit with £400 Bottega Veneta chain hoop earrings and a £1,000 Leo Zodiac diamond pendant from Brilliant Earth. She also wore Princess Diana's Cartier watch, which is worth £17,800, and a $62. Oh 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 Lorraine Schwartz pinky ring made with diamonds gifted from the Middle East. She also had a $2,800,1972 tennis pinky ring from Chiffon and Co on her finger. She completed her look with a £5,000 Cartier love bracelet. Later on, she switched to a sleek black dress as she met with a delegation for the 2025 Invictus Games in Canada. Meghan chose a £390 high-neck ribbed wool blend midi dress in grey from Totem, which she paired with £500 diaresence 100 black leather pumps. She kept her jewellery from earlier in the day and changed her earrings to £495 studs from Pippa Small. Finally, Meghan changed into her third outfit of the day, opting for a denim panel dress from Carolina Herrera that cost £1,033. She wore her Dior shoes again. For the occasion, she wore a necklace from Ariel Gordon jewellery that cost £2,062. Meghan joined her husband Prince Harry as he celebrated his 39th birthday with a stadium full of fans singing a German version of Happy Birthday at the Invictus Games in Dusseldorf, before a volleyball final medal ceremony that made Meghan Markle cry. The crowd first sang Happy Birthday in English after a commentator announced that it was Harry's 39th birthday. Then they continued with the German version of the song with the words Zum Geburtstag viel Gluck. The Duke of Sussex looked surprised as he waved awkwardly while the crowd sang and Meghan clapped along. He was then asked to stand up and walk to the front row where he fist-bumped Teddy, the Invictus Games mascot. When the English version of Happy Birthday ended, the commentator said, Prince Harry, wait a second, we are here in Germany. There is also a German version. And then the crowd sang the song in German. The birthday celebrations happened after the Duke and Duchess of Sussex got a warm welcome when they took their seats in the centre court stand to watch the sitting volleyball final between Poland and Colombia. The couple both had a beer to celebrate the Duke's 39th birthday. With Meghan, in her third outfit of the day, seen taking some quick sips of Harry's pint while he was talking to Johnny Mercer, the veterans minister. Meghan was later seen wiping tears from both eyes during a medal ceremony after congratulating athletes from Poland's winning volleyball team, following an intense game that made Prince Harry jump out of his seat with excitement, as the final points were scored. Remember to subscribe to British Royal Daily Update's YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell, this way you will be notified when we drop a video, stay safe.